something for sure the second one i was pregnant i was already three months guys so i need to see what i mean this um sangos goes from the previous story Story time. Was like, okay, fine. Don't stress yourself. I'm gonna tell your dad. Hi, hey, hey, hello, ones. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and you are welcome. Honey, I'm here trying to do a story time. If I am if Brazil, and nothing can stop me because I'm gonna do this. The Nicholas Yami hour. You know what? Everything is the girl because I want it to stay like this, but I fool me. So anyway. You are all welcome. Let me not waste time and get on to the story time. So today's story time is gonna be about how my parents found out that I was pregnant. Hmm. Sorry, guys. Hmm. Hmm. So guys, anati brutal in good. Yeah. So if you don't know. Um, I was pregnant 20, was it 2014, 2014, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. yeah, 2014, I was pregnant, unfortunately, my son didn't make it to a show another three months, may he so rest in peace, so, yeah, that's not the, the story of today, if you want to know good team, what happened, I will tell you guys some other time, but today we are going to focus on how my parents found out that I was pregnant. So, when I was doing grade 10, I met this boyfriend, which I thought was he is going to be my husband, my future everything, the love of my life, my everything, you know? So, we dated for, for about a month. But I actually decided, so, okay, okay, let me tell you guys what happened. This guy... Let me give you a background yana. I met this guy, I visited him a few houses away from like I didn't know him and then Gabona, this cute guy Nami. Bang Soma, I fell in love with him. It's a date and then a few days after that, Wahamba then. So I didn't know bank. I didn't know what he was saying or let's say so sorry guys about that so i didn't know what to be like and then we started dating because best july through he phone me i was doing grade 10 bigger seven nine so he would call me every day and then it's the kuluma and now and then so it happens good team washona a kai group then he was supposed to come this side because big shon a grand grandmother yak he came this side and then we decided to go and see each other we did the deed as usual I fell pregnant. Then Abu are like, okay, the same day Nagang meets. He told me good thing go meet his and I was like, Bani, mine, go meet me nang meet. And then he asked good thing, are you preventing now? Nah. I was like, no, I'm gonna meet me, but I know what I'm gonna meet. But then okay, fine. And then he went back. Eh, uh, a month down the line, I'm gonna go to my period. I'm aga 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 maybe now. You phone and you check with hey baby, me I'm pregnant la. I tell her, I don't know, me who's too preggy, because me and preggy sing that my pity's egg now preggy sign. I was like, what the fuck? What do you mean? Um, but, uh, we were cool with that. He knew that I was pregnant. And then life goes on. He came back or touched Salang and then for a few months. <laughs> so, guys, yeah, what was I saying? We we dated and then, oh, our boy or to Salang and then for a few months. And then, Nangiti in young, I is three. So long in my period, and the best and color mouth and change my mood. Thank you. I didn't want to go. It's super menstrual. Even today, I don't like it. I feel like it still smells so bad. Ne, ne cold drink ye, ye fanta. I think it's what? grape. I still don't like it because I feel like nasty solo. I, I see right. So, Mama, I know she's a good thing. There are some changes. You know, Boba, I get good punch and they know good thing that something they change it now, but they're not gonna tell you. So mama one day wang wang eh uh, on the floor because it was so so hot and then she asked me when last did you see your periods when I was like ah last month mine was it are you sure my beans I was so quiet because I I felt like she knew was it 
I'm pregnant. She was just asking just to pass time or just to get my answers. Um, you know? And I was like, eh eh. But now to show, what you mean, eh eh? What you mean? Oh, pregnant. I was like, <laughs> are you pregnant? I was like, she was like, okay, says that's what you wanted. Then, I don't know, she didn't say anything much. And cool, I think it was two weeks after because my magazine had been in my issues. Now, my magazine said, She didn't say anything that much. Then, one doula, um, after two weeks, or it was two weeks or a week. I think it was two weeks. Mamma and Papa not too bad, So, in fact, it was two. She called me, what's in Angambe? She want to ask me something. For sure, the second one, I was pregnant. I was already three months, guys. People can tell if someone I meet. What's in a Utrang Yelebu? And then, Mama, why are you poor, Mamma? What's in a Mama? Why are you going at me? Young Mamma, what's your end? I don't know. I'm going to find out what I would see. Am I pregnant now? And she was like, okay, fine, don't stress yourself. I'm going to tell your dad, Guti, you are pregnant. Now, be angala, everything would over say that. I was like, I'm a weird lala, mom. I guess I'm getting Guti pregnant. Obvious, Papa. Ever since it's so cool, and she's been telling us, Guti, once we are pregnant, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to take you, your father, M. Luma. There's this river, this side. Your father, M. Luma. I was like, what, mom? I guess I'm getting Papa. Ah, nah, mom. I'm going to, there's just a few houses away. I think four, five, six. I went to my mom and I'm feeling like I'm you pregnant. I was like, yeah, I'm going to put a bandage. So I'm going to put a bandage. Some goes from the previous story, story time. I'm going to put a bandage. And she was like, okay, fine. Uh, don't worry yourself. Everything is over sharp. I was like, cool, fine. Like, we didn't have much as well too much. And then she told me, I'm going to put a bandage. Papa, if I'm put a guti, mam yena be ang I should tell him guti. Uh, she wanted to ask guti next space yini escolen so that she can come and sell some snack or chips or whatsoever. And then I was like, okay, fine. Nang figure like ha ya. Benga ba na peshas the one from Sister Tech. Benga ba na peshas. And then Safi and Jim, what Papa yena? Like she was so. Furious, I could I could tell Guti no, Vele, so what is something, but still my instinct told me Guti no, I I got to loot. Just keep on lying. I feel my son, what's your name? They will be telling. I was like, they will be telling. I'm going to go to school and space in a school and so that I don't connect to you. She was like, he was like, they will be telling. And I but we are choose and I know Guti so shy. I was like, I was so scared, guys. I was so scared. Guys, it's a long story, but ngozi ubita papa ngamalu mosho mosho guti ki mungum zara mzaru zara ndo dana. You know, guys. <laughs> so yeah, that's it, papa. What's in here? When I from today, you are no longer my child. Actually, I'm not. I'm not gonna make color from precious. Give girl a bunny when I start some fun book to her like Guys, they chased me out, and I was crying the whole night, guti. What the fuck? What's gonna happen? Where am I gonna go? Carbon goes around. Like, I'm what no got. I'm what never directions because me and Matela la naga visit here. I didn't know who to. A guy who was straight in group. Yo, yo guys, I was so scared. I was crying the whole night. Lucky enough, Mkulle begasa pila. May his rose. May his soul rest in peace. Appear and he told me, Guti, don't stress yourself, nothing is gonna happen when I'm I win down. 
and now we were the following day i went to school because it was during the week and then when i was coming back from home like now now we like a gun like i am born class money takes you say hi yo <laughs> and already somebody that is no way good technology class money and then what's next i'm cheeky because i'm toshile What's gonna happen? I'm gonna have to fuck me. I'm banging a I got don't go shy serious. Don't forget that you're my family. Don't try and forget that you're my. Oh, don't go shy and ham. I'm gonna ham. I'm gonna feel like I'm gonna cry. And nothing happened. I'm banging a room in line. I'm gonna change uniform. He called me. I'm gonna go see his corner. Singo was like, "Good day, Singo. What's your name? Fine. Forget it, my dear Singo. So I'm gonna Singo. And life went on until today. I still his child. <laughs> so guys, yeah, that's how my parents found out that I was pregnant. Mama Mbutile and then I Angavuma. Then Papu Chelung Mama and I had to confess that I'm pregnant. And that's it, honeys. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe, share, comment. And yeah, guys, if you still want to know what happened to my child or the whole story or if you want me to tell you more stories please don't forget to tell me on the comment section and i'll keep you entertained ciao <laughs>